Welcome back to the channel and thank you very much for clicking this video. My name is Brandon Vincent. I'm a real estate agent with EXP Realty here in St. John, New Brunswick. If this is your first time coming in, thank you very much. Um, today's going to be a little bit different of, a, of an episode. It's going to be a little bit of a run and gun because here in St. John, we just had a nor'easter all day yesterday. Started in the morning and uh, didn't finish snowing until probably about 11, 11 p.m., like right around midnight. And uh, we, we got about 30 to 40 centimeters. And I want to take you around St. John and show you what, what the city looks like with a fresh fall of, uh, of snow. So come along, let's go, uh, let's go see. Just driving into, uh, into town here right now. And luckily I do have winter and studded tires. So able to kind of cruise through this, but uh, this would be an absolute nightmare for anybody that doesn't have uh, the proper tires on the vehicle, that's for sure. So for those of you interested in what St. John looks like after a nor'easter I mean this is this will give you a good idea let me just clean the windshield off here you know like okay so right behind me is a massive snowbank I'm actually here right now at the East Point Shopping Center um, parking lot and these commercial parking lots always have the biggest snowbanks because the plows are just drive in so much snow right but this is just an example of kind of how much snow we did get here I'll flip the camera around it's a bus stop right there all right so I'm uh, uptown here right now, uptown St. John, um, checking out the scene here. Everything seems to be pretty decent. Um, you know, all the plows obviously got rid of the snow very, very well. Like I said, it just, we got about 40 centimeters here within the last 24 hours. And uh, actually I strategically placed myself right, uh, right in front of a comedy club that I sponsor here in St. John, Punchlines Comedy Club. Absolutely amazing, amazing spot. Uh, they hold at least one or two shows uh, every month, and this is just such a morale booster for the city. I love it. I'm a proud sponsor. have been for over a year. It's a great place. You have to check it out. So we're doing all the sightseeing here today. Right now we're at the Reversing Falls here uh, at the Rapids and uh, taking a look, and the water is running like crazy because of all the snow we got. So I'll flip the camera around because this is kind of cool. But I was actually just here a few days ago, and there was absolutely... No, no snow at all. And um, so I'll just flip the camera around so you can see. So the roads have been a little slick so far. Um, and that's all right, just gonna drive with a little bit of caution. I highly recommended obviously to have winter tires this time of year. Uh, studs go a long way in this in this type of uh, in this type of weather. St uh, studs on the car, or sorry, on the tires, um, and uh, yeah, it's it's a little cold. So here now, back on the east side, um, at a uh, subdivision that I've been working with um, with R.J. Scott Homes and myself and um, my business partner in real estate, Mario Ciccoloni who uh, him and I both work with an amazing developer and builder, RJ Scott Holmes, he's been around for a long time and they built uh, actually all of this, all of this subdivision here. Um, but this one right behind me actually is super special because it's uh, being built for one of my clients in this area. In the last six months, we've built uh, four homes here and, um, and the clients are, are extremely happy. This is a gorgeous area and I, I actually grew up very close to here. Um, so, so the, so the subdivision actually has a special place in my heart, but I just thought I'd check in here real quick, see how the build is going. It looks absolutely amazing. And um, yeah, I hope this video has brought you some value so that you can at least see what St. John is like uh, after a nor'easter.
All right, so one last quick stop here right at Lumberjack Subs, right by the airport here in St. John. So if you ever fly into St. John and you're looking for a quick bite to eat after, stop into Lumberjack Subs here, literally right across the street from the airport. Um, Your sandwich is so good. So if you like what you've seen here today, hit the like, subscribe button, and um, stay tuned. Thank you very much for watching.